Sometimes practicing alone can be uninspiring, so I wrote some cool jazz improv exercises that you can practice with me. We'll be playing to a backing track so you can hear the notes that we're playing working against the chord changes. Use the timestamps to go over each part as many times as you want before moving on. The link to the free PDF is in the video description and in my pinned comment below. You can pause the video briefly and print it out or open the, the PDF on your iPad or a similar device. Let's get started. Today is a blues in the key of F. We're going to start with chord tones on beats one and three. Each one is going to have a two bar count in. So it's one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then we're in, okay? You excited? I know I am. Master. Thank you. 
one seemed to go a little bit better. Remember, if it feels like it's a bit too fast for you, you can pause it and run through it a few times, then try it again. Next, we're gonna play into the chord tones. Okay, now this one is approaching our chord tones. faster now. Here we go. Next one is approaching mostly from a scale tone above. Okay, now 
for the third one, slow, from above. Three, a little bit faster now. sweating a little bit. Now this next one we're gonna get into using enclosures. This one is mostly a scale tone or a whole step above our core tone followed by a half step below the core tone before we land on the core tone. Essentially it's sort of combining the first two. Okay so number four slow Thank you. 
that one again maybe what do you think I think I want to try that one again that speed for now for today uh, what do you think that one kicked my butt I have to admit I got snagged a couple of times there well how did you do so far let me know in the comments are you liking this so far um, I mean I know I'm not playing it perfectly so don't worry if you're not playing it perfectly maybe you can come back and show me up and play it better later let's keep going now we're gonna fill up every eighth note space available however this one i shortened it to just one page this time our enclosure is now going to be a whole step above then then down a half step and then lastly coming up a half step from below so let's say if our chord tone is the c i'm going to start on d which is a whole step above drop down a half step and come a half step below the C, which is B, and then finally land on the on the C. So it's going to be that's going to be uh, our basic enclosure for the whole thing. Okay, this one here should be 
a little bit easier because it's the same enclosure over and over. resistance now for this one I've written an etude where I tried to keep nearly all the target notes the chord tones the same but edited some differently or just took them out completely so that it would just sound more musical and leave space for our phrases okay now for the, the etude the solo Thank you. 
faster. Remember to bookmark this video so you can come back and practice it any time now that you have the PDF. You'll dig this video where I talk about some of the same things but teach you how to devise your own licks. And here's a playlist that I compiled of great videos just for you to get better at improvising jazz. Thank you.